media will have you believe that rising rates is all doom and gloom, especially if you buy your home in 2022. But they're lying. Because if you are one of those who bought their home with a high interest rate, you are in a great position. Why? We'll get to that in a second. The important thing is that you start doing your homework now so you can prepare to have more cash in your pocket every single month. Extra cash that I'm sure you'd want to spend elsewhere. I'm talking about refinancing and it's the ultimate money saver for you. But here's the catch. Timing is everything. Not just the timing of the actual refinance, but the timing of when you put the wheels in motion so you can start preparing for your option. And that's where this video comes in. I'm gonna show you the exact steps to refinance your home loan via these three genius methods. Methods so good that by the end of this video, you'll have everything you need to fight this recession. Make sure you watch till the end though, because I'm gonna share with you a secret hack so clever many miss and no one talks about. This is the ultimate solution that will make refinancing work for you. Ready? Let's go. Now do understand, there is a difference between conventional refinancing and then other type of loan refinancing. This is gonna be more around conventional refinancing. Other types like FHA Streamlines, VA Earls, or different type of programs we can cover in other videos. Method number one, putting the cost into your interest rate. This means that the cost for the refinance get covered by the lender giving you a higher interest rate. That interest rate has something we call rebate into it. That interest rate from the lender will have money needed to pay all the closing costs. The good thing about this is you keep your loan amount the same and nothing out of pocket. The bad thing, is your monthly payment typically goes up. This is one you want to do if you are anticipating another refinance in the short term. The second is paying the cost out of pocket. This means that your loan amount doesn't change, you get the lowest interest rate, but you're gonna have to fork up a lot more money than the other options. This can be a really great scenario, in my opinion, if you're planning to not refinance again and not touch this loan so you can get the most savings from a loan and an interest rate perspective. Third is you put the closing costs into your loan amount, meaning that if there's enough equity, you can finance all the costs for the refinance into the loan itself. The pros of this is that you have nothing out of pocket and you still get a lower monthly payment many times than putting the cost into the interest rate. The con is that you just increased your loan amount and you'll be paying more interest over the life of the loan. Now you know the three methods to make refinancing work for you. Here's a secret hack to help you save no matter which option you decide is best for you and your future. Combining all three, many times the best savings is taking a little bit of a higher interest rate, coming out of pocket with a little bit in your prepaids because that typically will be refunded to you anyways, and financing a little bit into your loan amount. Combining all three and making a custom refinance plan for yourself in light of all your goals and home situation will get you the most savings possible. Refinancing is not just about having a lower monthly payment or just about saving. A refinance should be a tool you and your mortgage advisor use to identify how do we ensure our long-term goals are accomplished best. Retirement, healthcare, security, savings, tax planning, all those need to be considered so you make the best custom plan to accomplish everything you desire and deserve. With rising interest rates and economical uncertainty, it's more important now than ever to build a strategy to help you brace for the recession. Using these methods will do that, but using this secret hack I just shared will help you benefit five times more. The best way to get started is to get talking. Find a trusted expert near you and start planning now. You don't need to wait for the recession to end. Get active and start using a refinance plan to be stress-free this year. What questions do you have about refinancing? Drop them in the comments below and I'll do my best to be able to answer every single one of them. As always, subscribe, like, and share, and I'll see you in the comment section.